Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to Rascal Does Not Dream of a Dreaming Girl. Okay. Oh God, I don't know what to say about this. Like, I, I'm really excited for this movie. I've been excited for this ever since last year when I did a full reaction on my first channel on this whole freaking series, and I was a mess during that series, so I already know automatically I'm going to be a mess during this. Um... So I'm going to basically tell you like this. So typically, if you've seen any of my reactions with videos, with not for videos, with movies like uh, Fate. Yeah, just Fate. Because I was about to say like Tanya and I haven't watched it yet. Um, I had to put it into part. So I'm going to go all the way to like the 55 um, point 50 minute mark. And then I'll probably talk a little bit more and stuff. I really don't want to watch this because of the fact is I'm not ready to cry on a Friday, on the 6th of December, several days after Maya's birthday, thank you very much, and cry over this. I was really supposed to watch this um, sometime last week, like the day the day I got asked. Between fr last Friday and last Saturday, I was supposed to watch this. Then I was supposed to watch it on Sunday, then Monday, and then Tuesday, and then Thursday, and today is really the only day I can absolutely 100% watch this, because I'm going to be busy as hell next week. And I don't want to fucking cry. I mean, I want to know what's going to happen with Shoko because, you know, the way the anime ended, like, it seemed like we were in the start of hers, but I was like, no, we're going to have to wait until the movie. And I also almost had an opportunity to go see this movie two months ago because um, it was playing five, ten minutes away from me, but I was over where I used to live. Because I had to go do something with my mother. And unfortunately, I wasn't able to go see this movie. And I really wanted to go see it. But we're going to go ahead and watch it now. So I'm going to go ahead and pause this. And you'll see me in one second for the first half of this movie. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. <sighs> okay. I'm guessing that, yeah, that's Shoko. <sighs> I want to do this. This might hurt more than the damn series three years ago. Are we going to see Baby Kaya? No, Baby Sawyer. <laughs> Oh. You don't know what you're gonna do, don't you? This is gonna fucking hurt. I'm not ready for this. Thank God! <laughs> Wasn't that the problem she was having in, in the anime? I mean, it's been a damn year. Yeah. No. Even though it's not the guy. Amari, 
me about to fucking tear up. Oh my god. Okay, hold on. But is it older Shoko or is it younger? Mm -hmm. She's not going to do anything with the knife. She'll be fine. Wait, what? Except you're the older one. What are you, Benjamin Button? Us? Well, then, why don't you invite Nodoka, Tomoe, Kudaba, invite everybody. I just like the fact that she's like me. I just want to say but that shell go in it. <laughs> so the older one, okay. I mean, but hold up. Is it possible that both the younger and the older Shoko could possibly run into each other? And if they touch, they're gonna... Oh my god! <laughs>
Why the fuck am I crying at seven minutes in this movie? Come on. Heart disease. So you possibly should have died in middle school. But then I'll hold up. Wait, 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 wait. I think so. God damn, we're going through the dates fucking quickly. Next thing you know, it's going to be January 1st. That means the older Shoko wrote that down. So then maybe it seems like the younger Shoko is, I don't know, because like, my head hurts! <laughs> Okay, no, this is how I'm going to say it. The younger Shoko made a projection of her older, and the older one made her one of uh, of her being younger. And that's why they're at the same time. <laughs> Fucking tiny, limey, freaking Doctor Who. What is this?
Yeah, because remember, you were in love with that show goes on two years ago. I wouldn't be surprised if that one showed up too. Something bad gonna happen by Christmas. I know it. In my heart. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. So anything that the older one says, it mm, girl, what? <laughs> it immediately comes out. It's almost my mom's birthday in this anime. <laughs> It's immediately on the paper. Are y'all gonna play the damn song? Oh my god. The scar. And it's my mom's birthday. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's his girlfriend, duh. How? Something about this ain't right. But what could she have done that's so bad that she would hide from me?
You say that, but you hide something. A tour? A tour of what? What is it like an aquarium or something? You know, I was going to spend money on this figure, but, like, I don't think it isn't even sold anymore. Between that and the my figure, because I really wanted the my one. Yeah, but see, the more and more we get closer to Christmas, something bad's gonna happen. Mm. It's gonna fucking hurt. That's a, that's the fucking deal breaker right there. If he goes with Shoko and spends time with Shoko, something bad's gonna happen. Like, what if he? Oh my god, I can't think about what the hell's gonna happen. I'm scared. And they keep tearing up, oh my god!
So there's that. And guess what? You're gonna hang out with her! Scar.
first thing is how the hell you get to the damn hospital without everybody saying anything about you. That's my oh my god. You're not gonna die. You're not gonna go to an easy guy. You ain't even gonna be known to me. Because you know if you die, you can be the guy. You'll go be with her, but you know what I'm telling you. <laughs> trying to be so freaking lighthearted and funny, but I can't. Yeah, this hurts. This hurts more than when he was trying to get Kayane out of the house.
Oh my god, it's been a couple of days. You know about it too? <laughs> that is if you make it out of life. <laughs> Mm -mm. He's okay. Really far. She just wants to be with you. I know. There's got to be something else you can do. I'm getting so many fucking feels to the last goddamn episode. <laughs> you do you. See, this is something awesome that would do about Kitty Toe. Oh my god! <laughs> I can't. It's too much. My heart! Can you imagine if I went to the movie theater to watch this?
I thought I live in a really nice place. No, no, you start crying too! He gonna do something stupid and change it, ain't he? He gonna be stupid and he gonna look at I swear to God, if you make this girl cry. Please go home safe. Take a train. Something. You don't have to walk home. Well, yeah, because
Why not? <laughs> Choco. But how though? You gotta really take a moment in the past, are you?
Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. With her, she's gonna take you in the. Oh, you can say this girl. <laughs> Ew. After the accident where he got the scar? That. But then if he saves mine, what about you? You're not going to be here, are you? That's okay. So, you know what this reminds me of? You remember Steins Gate? You remember what I reacted to Steins Gate? And that is <laughs> the same, my <laughs> Okay, it's about to be over. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Oh my God. Oh, <laughs> what happened in the first 55 minutes and I wasn't ready for it? This was too much. Like, oh my God. This girl is dead. My is dead and this hurts. Oh my God. Like, just imagine if I was in the movie theater watching this, I would have been on the floor. My mom probably would have looked at me like I was fucking crazy. <laughs> I just would have been there like... <laughs> oh my god. No. I don't even want to... Oh my god. I don't even want to go back and look at those scenes because Jesus Christ. It's just... Oh my... I wasn't expecting all of that. I wasn't expecting any of this to happen. I was thinking that everything was going to be fine. And that he was going to go with mine. And nothing else. And then he writes. And I'm like, oh my god, something's coming. Something's coming. <laughs> my dumb ass said, now for me. Now for me. <laughs> oh. oh my god. Mm -mm. 
This hurt, and we're not even done. We're not even done with this movie, and this freaking hurt. I don't even know how the, like, the second half of this movie is gonna end. We have, like, less than 30 minutes before this movie is done. My throat hurts. <laughs> I don't want to cry anymore because, god dang it, that really freaking hurt. Like, oh my god, just. Oh god, I don't want to cry again. Please tell me the second half is not going to make me cry anymore because I don't want to cry anymore. That was too freaking much. I cried more in this than I than the freaking entire show during the whole freaking like what 12 13 episodes of that damn show. Oh my god, like you just broke my heart, ripped it up into pieces, threw it on the ground, stomped on it. I mean, like Oh my god, Talia! Oh my god! My baby! Alright, alright. I'm okay. I'm not okay, not really. Go ahead and pause this video. And I will see you guys in one second for the second half of this movie. <laughs> okay. Part two is three, two, one, go. Thank God my eyes aren't fucking red because, oh, I, I just feel like a mess right now. It's the morning up, right? Okay, please. Please. Don't fuck this up. Write something on the wall. Write something on the wall. There's no service. A bunny poster? Oh my god, thank god. Oh my god, thank you. You can see him. <gasps> Hi, puppy. Now, you know what would have been funny? If they showed this at the beginning of the movie, and then we, yeah, you know, play backwards. Mm -hmm. What I'm trying to say, basically. Mm -hmm. They should have showed this at the beginning.
And she's already okay with it. This isn't right. You're opening up a freaking timeline. This isn't good. Even when she was on the, when she was on the phone, she knew what she was gonna do already. Oh my god. Of course you do with you, you idiot. <laughs> But then you'll die. <laughs> yeah, it's okay.
I remember seeing this part in the trailer and immediately thinking that was my the whole entire time. But then the question is, no, because I don't think you would have memory of that, so. Yeah, she's gone. You better go hug the shit out of her, I swear to God. <laughs> okay, y'all had to hug now. Yeah, I can say. <laughs> You idiot, you made everybody worry. You made me worry too. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> way too much. Mm -hmm. It's okay. You, you don't have to get it, babe. It's just time travel. And it's complicated as fuck. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay. The list are all gone. It's possible. Doesn't Kayede should have one? Tomo should have one? Like, literally everyone should have one. Yeah. And then you never would have met mine. And then you never would have had that accident. Mm. Yeah, you want to be like the freaking Haruhi Suzumiya movie? Please tell me he ain't gonna be an idiot and try to do that shit. Like, mm -mm. I can't do this again, okay? It's pretty emotional enough as is. want to go to? <laughs> you better, you freaking idiot, I swear to God. We got 15 minutes. <laughs> Oh. 
I should not want you to do that. I don't know.
Oh, they are that bitch. That bitch. They need it. Okay, no. All right. Did you break up with your fucking girlfriend? I mean, we all know she was a bitch. If they see her at the god dang beach. Because it's shocking. <laughs> That's Shoko, ain't it? It is. Aww. Oh. Oh. Mm -mm. Just a feeling, though, right?
Oh. No! <laughs> you are not playing this song! No! Oh my god! I had a feeling! I had a feeling! No, mm -mm, you're not going to make me cry anymore. I fucking love this damn <laughs> mm -mm. Okay. Alright, hold on. And it's worse because they all singing it. Oh my god. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> this movie was good. It was really good. Oh my god, finally. I'm so happy I was able to watch this, but Jesus Christ, I wasn't ready for all of this, god dang it. Like, that really hurt. But I'm happy. Like, they don't need to make anything else. You can end it like that. Don't give me anything else. As much as I want something else, you don't need to give me anything else. That was a perfect ending, honestly. But then it makes you want to, want to know what could possibly happen next. But still, it was perfect. It's been a whole year since we watched this dang show. And the funny thing was, I think a couple of months ago, I was bored, and I was like, you know what? I kind of want to rewatch the first episode. So I, I rewatched the first episode only. I didn't watch any other because I was like, if I sit and rewatch this damn show, I'm literally going to fucking cry all over again, and I can't do that. But the funny thing was, two days later, <laughs> after it was done recording, I sat up and I watched the rest of the damn show again. And I was like, yeah, you know, I kind of need a good behind cry today. And it was like that today. I needed a good cry today. And you just gave me this. And I'm so happy. Thank God I didn't get to see this in movie theaters. Because I would have been bawling the whole entire time. I would have left the movie theater. My mom would have been driving us home. I would have been over here like crying. Still crying. Coming home. Laying on my bed. Crying. <laughs> until eventually I would have fell asleep. And I just would have been like, yeah. That happened. But it was really good. I mean... Uh, that touched me so fucking much. But like, my God, that first half, my, oh my God. I was thinking, yeah, okay, it's just going to go like it's supposed to. He's going to die. That's it. Heart change. No, but my best girl, my mother, Effie, Beth Talia, with the say, she's like, nope, not going to let my mouth of me get hurt. No, <laughs> That broke me. That freaking broke my behind. I was about to be like, well, I'm done. I don't want to watch this. Like, oh my god. Seeing who? Just her phone. Seeing her phone crash. Her on the ring. I'm just so happy. I'm so happy. Everything's okay now. Everything's okay, but that fucking hurt. I don't want to experience that again. Oh my god. Like, dude, no. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. But it was good. You know what? It, you know, it'd be really funny, and I'm going to be stupid saying this, and I, I can't believe I'm going to say this, too. If my freaking ex messaged me and was like, hey, you know, we watched this show together, technically, even though you did reactions on it, and I watched your videos and ish, but I want to watch it together. If we sat together and watched it, I'd ball my eyes out all over again and just be like, mm, don't talk to me. Just don't fucking talk to me. Like, oh my god, just even seeing my, like, literally trying to do everything in her power to just make sure that they could just be far away, that they could just be together. But so I didn't want that. Even though I wanted it for him, I was like, you could be with her. It's it. It's gonna be fine. But then it's like, no, we gotta think about Shoko. We gotta think about myself. We gotta think about Kaede. Like, even him saying goodbye to Kaede. Like, that fucking hurt. Everything about this film hurt. Oh my god. But, 
it was good. Like, 10 out of 10. Would recommend. Oh my god. Like, oh. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh my god. I can't even imagine if, like, I sat with my mom and I watched this. Like, this is worse than when my mom and I... My mom, my, my mom, my mother's friend and I all sat and watched freaking The Silent Boys. So it's my second time watching the dang film. And then my mom falls asleep and my mom's friend and I was like sitting there crying her ass off. Like, oh my God. Dude, no, I just, mm -mm. I, I just, I wasn't ready for all of that. Like, dude, oh my God. I was thinking this was going to be, I knew it was going to be sad. I knew there were going to be moments, but I was not expecting, because I remember in the trailer, like, seeing the car hitting Sakuta, but then I immediately, because, like, I was thinking, like, okay, he's going to be fine, right? No, 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 because, like, you know, of course, a trailer can't really show you everything, and I think that was, like, the trailer where it has both um, him and Shoko looking. I think that was the only trailer that came out, and I got to see that trailer twice. The Japanese version for it, and then the freaking Animatoplex version. And I was just like, yeah, that's all I'm going to see. I don't want to get spoiled by this movie. Thank God nobody spoiled me on this freaking movie, because I would have been so pissed if I got spoiled on this. Like, mm, -mm. I, I can't imagine that. Like, because <laughs> let's go back to October. Uh, like, I think this movie came out October 10th. October, uh, October 10th at another day, because it was coming out a week earlier in Canada. And two people who I know who actually got to see the film. They went to go see it, and it was, like, maybe a couple of hours after they saw the film. They came back, they talked about it a little bit, but they didn't put, like, any spoilers. And they kind of said, I, oh my god, it's been, like, two months, I think I'm gonna remember. They said something about the fact is, and this is what I immediately thought it was gonna be like, that it was just gonna be a recap film for, like, the first half of the movie, and then the second half of the movie was going to be like, oh, okay, Here's everything else. Like, this is everything. Here's the situation. What's going to happen? Here's how Sakita's going to solve it. Da-da-da. Endgame. That's it. So, I was, like, I think around that time, two months ago on the 10th, I was a little hesitant to actually watch it. But then I was thinking, I was like, well, maybe it's not like that. So, then I was just like, yeah, it's kind of good I didn't go see this movie in theaters because I probably would have said maybe the exact same thing. But, ooh, no. I it just, ooh. Uh-uh. Because in a way, it kind of continued right where the anime left off, which was really good. I, I'm glad it didn't do any really recap. I mean, just like the freaking compilation of showing everything from the last episode all the way to the first episode, seeing the meet, it, it's like that. Like that almost got me. I almost wanted to cry again and stuff. But like even seeing like moments that I loved throughout the damn series. Just, oh my god, it was too much. <laughs> I just wanted to be like, yeah, that's it. Let's just go ahead and end the movie right here. We don't need to continue anything anymore. Oh my god. But just, it was really good. And I'm really happy that they did this. Because, I mean, they could have did a season two. And they could have, I don't know, because they could have did anything for it. But I'm glad, like, if something else comes for this show, I'll be happy. If not, I'm... I'm happy. No matter what they do. I, I'm, I'm, I'm good. I am Gucci. I am satisfied about this. They don't really need to do anything else. Be like freaking Harahi. Don't do anything else with Harahi. Don't do anything else with any other freaking series that is like this. I don't want anything else. Even though you're kind of doing that with that one other series that I like that's coming out next year, which is season three. You're doing that. They're doing that. I'm fine with that. And I, I just don't hope, I kind of hope that they don't really do a movie because it's like, I don't, you don't need anything else for really any of these series that do, um, that really have, like, an open ending. Because I feel like Monogatari is going to be like that whenever I finish Monogatari sometime next year. Or, um, anything that comes after this Monogatari, uh, the Teenage Snafu show, and a couple other shows that are very similar to it. I don't want it to be like, okay, it'd be like several years down the line, and it's like, okay, we got one more thing to tell you. But... It happens. You never know. But I really enjoyed this. And I hope you all enjoyed watching me cry for like, hmm. That's the real reason why you wanted me to watch this movie. You wanted to just sit here and watch my behind cry because in the beginning, I'll be like, <laughs> I'm 
not gonna cry and then what freaking happens i end up crying my butt off and then i'm like yeah just leave me alone i just want to be in my feels and stuff i was like my god oh my god i it's like i needed that mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> I just, you know, honestly, now I really want the figure of, like, either Shoko or Mai in the wedding dress. Because, like, Mai looked pretty in the freaking wedding dress figure. Because, like, if you haven't seen that, like, go find that. And it's just, like, oh, my God. Just bask in the amazingness of how pretty Best Mother Effing Girl looks. Because she looks so pretty in it. And it's just, like, oh, my God. And then, like, Shoko. Oh, my God. I wonder if they're going to have, like, the freaking heart transplant thing on her. I don't know. Who knows? But I really want it now. I really do. <laughs> okay. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards Rascal Does Not Dream of a Dreaming Girl. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magic Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys. I don't know. Really. Honestly. Because uh, I still need to do... The Tawny movie, because I've been, like, procrastinating on that, too. And there's kind of something else that I want to watch. Pretty here. Well, when that comes out next year. Maybe the Connoisseur kind of movie. I might watch that on my own. I'm not 100% sure. I don't know. Who knows? But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye, guys.